Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a Fiat or Alfa Romeo, guys. Why both of those? Because they're built on the same platform, practically the same company. And if your air conditioner blows hot air, warm air, guys, you want to know the top five why your air conditioner doesn't work, stay with us, we'll explain that in this video today before we start let me tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos why we guys do that because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need guys in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos and if you guys need to buy any parts tools for a good price and quick shipping check out the link in the description of the video below you can save a ton of money so with that being said what can cause ac air conditioner not to work guys okay let's talk about that now so how the ac system works ac system you have a condenser okay that cools on the phone that's a condenser then you have freon in the system okay you will have certain pressure in the system you have a compressor that compresses that freon produces cold practically the heat comes to the front the cold goes in the dash and you will have a switch to turn the uh, uh, AC compressor on and off. You have a clutch that will engage the compressor and you have an AC pressure switch that will detect how much pressure you have in the system. Our AC compressor is all the way on the back side, almost not visible. That's the compressor right here. Okay, that's the clutch. Okay, it will engage to the pulley. The pulley will engage the compressor and it will start working once you turn it on. So, that AC clutch will be one thing that can easily cause the AC not to work. Number two, having a free on leak. Free on leak can be caused by a leaking gasket, seal or broken holes. Now we have the system connected if the engine is running and the AC is on. Uh, uh, if you have good pressure, okay, it means that actually it's not the free on. If it's in the low, it means you have uh, you need to add free on. And we'll have a special video that will explain how to recharge free on. Number three. It could be a bad AC pressure switch. The purpose of the AC pressure switch is to detect uh, how much pressure you have in the AC system. So the uh, actually the engine computer will determine if it's safe to turn the compressor on, to engage the clutch. And if that AC pressure switch does not work, actually your AC air conditioner will not work as well. Next, it could be guys, okay, weak or worn AC compressor, air conditioner compressor that cannot produce enough pressure. And another thing could be bad radiator fan. If the radiator fan does not work, the engine computer will actually turn the air conditioner off so the car, okay, have uh, a smaller chance to overheat. That's a safety feature. Next, guys, okay, the fan may not be working because of a bad radiator fan, bad, uh, bad uh, fuse, radiator fuse, and bad radiator relay. If you want to see how to test radiator fan on Fiat or Alfa Romeo, guys, we have the video on the channel that will teach you how to do that without removing it. After that, check the uh, fuse and the relay for the air conditioner, okay, for the AC clutch, and test the AC clutch. We will have a video how to test AC clutch on Fiat, Alfa Romeo, and we'll have a video how to test AC pressure switch on Fiat and Alfa Romeo as well. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.